What is up, my fellow Chibits? Today, I'm here to bring all of you an anime first impressions of a new anime series from Summer of Anime 2016, A Mama. I think that's how you say it. Anyways, before I get into my first impressions, I want to say happy 4th of July to all of you Chibits that are currently celebrating, and even if you're not celebrating it, because I know not everyone celebrates 4th of July, because there's so many Chibits out there that are not in the States, I just want to say I still wish you all a very wonderful day, and I hope all of you continue to have many wonderful days for your future, and just have some really good fun today. So anyways, diving into my first impressions of this series, very adorable. First words I want to say adorable it's so fucking adorable it is so adorable it is so freaking adorable it's so cute and i i think this is a type of series that if you're wanting to see a very cutesy slice of life type series with a little bit of drama here and there this might be the series for you and i don't know if i'm probably going to review this series episodically because it might not warrant it because the contents in said episode might not be enough for a full length you know review episode review but I will say this, however, I do fully recommend, as an anime fan, I do recommend watching this series. It is completely fun. I love the comedy to the sad and happy moments throughout this episode. It was just truly a treat. And it was a great way to just start a morning of anime, or just start anime for today. And, like, let me just point out some certain points about this episode that really stood out to me. So, the main male character, the father... He is going through a difficult time. His wife has recently passed away, and the family has currently faced a loss. The father is currently having to take on the duties of what the mother once did, and having to help out his child, his daughter. And it's a very difficult situation, and you could tell that he's trying his best to kind of fulfill that role as a mother figure, as well as a father figure, for his daughter. Because the way, throughout the majority of this episode, you saw how he was constantly wanting to make good food. He was thinking about what he was making. He realized that his food didn't live up to the standards of what his daughter wanted. And his daughter wasn't necessarily being rude, or very stuck up, or bratty. It's just, it was like a traditional little girl, little daughter you would have. And the way she was acting, for instance, when she brought back the food, the bento box, it was like daddy and all that it was like this good and all that and you see how the box had a little bit of food here and there throughout the different compartments it lets you know that she didn't really like the food all together but she was kind enough to say she ate it and she did you know want to eat it and all that and she did care for her daddy and it was such an emotional moment because you could see where the father is really trying because he's you know been through a loss and so is the daughter they have lost you know their wife and they've also lost their mother and it's a very sad moment to think about this of how majority of this episode is spent where the father is trying to take that role of being able to care for his daughter now necessarily I don't think that the girl that we saw in this episode especially towards the end might become the new mother figure for the daughter but there is a possibility I mean I've seen a lot of weird shit in anime I, I have I've seen a lot of weird shit and all that there is a possibility that that girl might try to fall in love or something with the sensei the father figure and get together with them but I, I just don't know. But anyways, the main thing is, is that majority of this episode is kind of about the father trying to make his daughter happy. And that's what this series is about. It's about a father trying to raise his daughter by himself. And if you're into those type of series, if you're into a series where a parent is having to take care of his daughter while doing work, and also having to do all the housework as well and all that, this is a series for you. It's a very down-to-earth and very refreshing series for this anime season. I've seen, I think, only two series, anime series, that have ever done something like this in the past. I've only seen two anime series. I'm not counting a moto. I'm not, I'm not counting, you know, that type of series. I'm actually just, you know, counting series that had a father figure taking care of a daughter or some form of, you know, child. That's what this reminds me of. And I say it's a very wonderful start. It's a good start. I Like I said, I don't know if I will do episodic reviews for the series because it's a series that might have content that could be just nothing but comedy, and there's not, not really much to talk about in that given episode. But if I will say this, however, even if I don't do episodic reviews, it is a series worth watching. And I'm definitely going to continue watching it, definitely. It, it was something I liked. I really was smiling and just, you know, getting all these little feels inside of me. And then just seeing, you know, the, the dog. Daughter. She was just so cute and adorable throughout the entire episode, the way she was acting. The voice actor, too. The voice actor for that daughter nailed all the key emotions and adorable scenes. I really wish that, you know, the actor probably got a raise. Like, that actor definitely needs a raise for the acting skills used in this episode of this series. So, yeah. 
Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Did you enjoy this series? Did you hate this series? How do you feel about the first episode? Please let me know in the comments below. Are you going to continue watching it? I love you all so much. Please be safe. Chibi